Hey, how's it going everybody? This is Sean Nightfire and I want to talk to you guys about the Craftsman Universal Max Axis Socket Set. So, I haven't actually seen too many reviews on YouTube of this. Uh, I've seen like a promotion from Ace and some other really short videos, but I want to give you my take. And uh, reason being is I like this set a lot and uh, definitely want to go over some of uh, the features here. So, first off, this is made by Craftsman. Um, real quick, talk about Craftsman. Uh, a lot of you will say, you know, Craftsman's not the brand that it was 20 years ago, and to some extent that's true. Uh, once Sears went down, they kind of had to maybe go from sort of a prosumer to more of a do-it-yourselfer kind of brand line. Um, you know, Milwaukee, DeWalt, those bigger brands already had a foothold in some of the other big box chain stores. So I think in many cases they had to kind of scale back their operations. Um, but this product in particular, I think they knocked it out of the park. This is some high quality stuff. So let's just look at some of the features. Um, now this socket set, I've seen, there's this one here, which comes with a three eighths and quarter inch drive. Uh, I see some smaller sets that don't have as many sockets and some bigger sets that have a half inch drive as well. So I got a couple projects so I'm missing some sockets in the moment. The socket goes from 25 millimeter down to four millimeter. And then on the standard sizes, one inch down to five thirty seconds. And there's some redundancy between uh, 9 30 seconds and 5 eighths on the standard side and 8 millimeter to 15 millimeter so there's some redundancy in those sizes which is nice because they're the sizes most people use uh, just in case you lose a socket um, but this what's special about this socket it does have the uh, pass-through design so if you have a long bolt or whatnot um, that bolt will pass through and you, you don't need a deep socket, so that works really well. Um, also, it has a unique kind of universal design of the socket. It works good with square drives and um, really holds on well. And the fact that it uh, kind of slots in there, they claim it's the socket is 40% stronger since it's not you know such a small pressure point. Um, other things included in this kit is, of course, you got your extenders. This is a bit driver, connects to the uh, quarter inch drive. And then you put uh, this little bit driver in there, and then you can, I'm oh, sorry, open here. This one, and then you can put any of your bits in there. That works really well. Uh, you also, hmm, there's there. I haven't used that in a while. Um, you have a, so you can use regular sockets. Let's say you want to use a, take off some spark plugs and still use a wrench. You can use that because even though these are pass-through design, that's not going to work with like a spark plug or something. Same with a quarter inch. Uh, this one is just drops down from a three eighths to a quarter inch. So you can use this for all the sockets instead of using the quarter inch just in case you can't find the quarter inch socket drive. So for most do-it-yourselfers, works great. Um, pros on this set, I must say that it is incredibly strong. Um, I was taking off some lower control arms using the 3 8 inch drive and I didn't have enough torque, so I kind of made myself a breaker bar using... Actually, I got it right here. Uh, this is for my floor jack. Just get that panned in there. Pretty lengthy, I don't know, about two feet long. <laughs> the other side. Yeah, I put that sucker in there, and I put pretty much all my effort in turning this bolt, and this thing held up fine. So... Uh, yeah, incredibly strong between just this is made Incredibly strong. I don't know what kind of steel they use, but very strong wrench Plus just the design of it and then these sockets they don't slip at all. So 
even for a rounded bolt. Designed incredibly well. So really like that. I've had other sockets break and wrenches break, so never had a problem with this one. Uh, cons, I would say, one thing the set doesn't come with, so you have, if you want to use a regular socket, you can use that, but uh, what I would have liked is an adapter going the other way. Let's say I want to use, I really like a lot of these sockets, I want to use a socket with um, like an impact driver, pretty much the opposite of this, where I could stick it onto an impact driver and use it that way. So, I don't know if they make that. I haven't really seen them. That would have been really nice. Um, the other cons. I got this one from a military exchange for, I don't know, it was around 60 bucks. Incredible deal. However, you cannot find these things. <laughs> Online, I've seen them in Amazon. They're not made anymore or sold out or whatever. I can't even find them there. I saw them on Sears.com. And uh, possibly you'll find them at Ace since they were promoting them for a while. So, yeah, if you're lucky enough to find them, definitely get it. Definitely, if you find it, pick it up. Um, the smaller set I've seen go for around $50 on Ace. I think it's worth the deal, but I'd rather have the bigger set with the uh, more sockets. Um, what else? Yeah, like I said, hard to find. Um, overall, great set if you're just a do-it-yourselfer. Obviously not something to replace, you know, your snap-on. You know, if you do a lot of vehicle work, uh, pretty limited. Um, but for, you know, 90, 95% of do-it-yourself jobbers, this is, this is perfect. Um, yeah, uh, hope you guys like the review. Uh, like, share... Subscribe, comment below, always answer the comments, play Raid Shadow Legends or whatever game they're playing, and uh, see you next time.